हेलो एवरीवन आई एम डॉक्टर परजीत कौर एसोसिएट डायरेक्टर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ एंडोक्रोनोलॉजी एट मेदांता हॉस्पिटल गुरुग्राम सो थायरॉयड इज़ अ ग्लैंड इट्स अ स्मॉल हार्मोन प्रोड्यूसिंग ग्लैंड प्रोड्यूसिंग इन द सेंटर ऑफ आर नेक व्हिच प्रोड्यूसेस टू हार्मोन्स टी थ्री एंड टी फोर एंड दीज हारमोन्स आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर द नॉर्मल मेटाबॉलिज्म ऑफ ईच एंड एवरी सेल इन आर बॉडी ना वॉट काइंड ऑफ थायरॉयड डिसऑर्डर्स यू कैन हैव देर आर थ्री मेन थायरॉयड प्रॉब्लम सम वन कैन हैव One problem is hypothyroidism, in which T3, T4 टी फोर लेवल्स बिकम लो यानी कि आपके शरीर में हॉर्मोन लेवल की कमी हो जाती है विच कैन रिजल्ट इन ईदर सिम्टम्स लाइक फैटी क्लेथार्जी कॉन्स्टिपेशन या फिर कई बार लेवल कुछ ज़्यादा कम नहीं होता है तन सम वन इज़ कम्प्लीटली ए सिम्टोमेटिक अनदर कंडीशन इज़ हाइपर थायरॉयडिज्म इन विच टी थ्री टी फोर हारमोन लेवल्स बिकम वेरी हाई दैट मीन्स आपके शरीर में थायरॉयड हारमोन्स की काफ़ी ज़्यादा क्वान्टिटी में बनने लगते हैं इससे क्या होता है या तो वेट लॉस होना शुरू हो जाता है या शरीर में हल कपाहट शुरू हो जाती है धड़कन तेज़ हो जाती है दिल की इंक्रीज स्वेटिंग होने लगती है गर्मी ज़्यादा लगती है थर्ड काइंड ऑफ थायरॉयड प्रॉब्लम क्या हो सकती है कई बार हमारे थायरॉयड ग्लैंड में छोटी छोटी गांठें बन जाती हैं जिसको हम बोलते हैं थायरॉयड नोड्यूल्स ना हम किस तरह से इस थायरॉयड प्रॉब्लम्स को डिटेक्ट कर सकते हैं इट्स अ वेरी सिंपल टेस्ट वेरी सिंपल ब्लड टेस्ट जिसमें हम चेक करते हैं टी थ्री और टी का लेवल and depending upon these levels we diagnose whether the person has hypothyroidism or a hyperthyroidism but the best part of these thyroid disorders is that these disorders are very easily manageable so definitely you need to consult your endocrinologist if you are noticing any of these signs or symptoms or you find any abnormality in the blood test if you have got the test done from outside for example for hypothyroidism it's a very easy management that you take a simple thyroid hormone pill early in the morning and that will take care of your thyroid hormone levels similarly for hyperthyroidism you just need to take some anti thyroid medications which are given for a certain period of time only it's not a lifelong treatment thyroid nodules are also easily manageable and the best part is 95% of these thyroid nodules are benign which means ki cancer is nahi hote hain but very important part in thyroid problem is to understand there are a lot of myths associated with it like people think that this is a lifestyle disorder exactly this is not a lifestyle disorder and there is no major dietary restriction associated to it like for example people are not aware they stop eating cabbage cauliflower carrot and so many other things which is not at all right what is important in fact is that in your diet you should have adequate iodine in your diet which is usually get it from the iodized salt so a lot of people actually stop taking this iodized salt and then they develop some kind of a thyroid problem that should not be done another important myth is that a lot of people we they start self medication they find a sub problem in the blood test and they start taking the thyroid pill and they keep on taking life long which is not correct in fact many people don't even need thyroid treatment at such small disturbance in the blood test many a times they are taking the treatment when they come to us we stop the treatment and they're completely fine so do consult your endocrinologist if you're taking the thyroid treatment for a long long time you may not actually need it on the other hand some people they really do need this treatment and they need it to like let's that like this treatment has to be taken lifelong it's not that you get habitual to it it's just that your body needs this hormone to be taken lifelong so what i want to conclude it with that this thyroid disorder is is a very easily manageable problem it's not a very big hormonal problem in fact it's the mildest of all the hormonal problems we treat all you need to do is that you need to be aware of the important uh, facts associated with thyroid and you should consult your endocrinologist if you have got some abnormal thyroid result or you are already taking some thyroid medication thank you